Hey everyone, I want to talk to you about Vial today and I just, my lips are a little red still, I just took off my, my Vial stuff so I wanted to, because I want to show you how to put it on. So a couple things, um, you have to have a primer for the Vial to be working, okay, so that's, a, that's the part that has the fermented date oil in it, um, that's what helps with moisturizing and um, keeping it staying on. So as you're doing it, you want to wipe off all the extra stuff, boop, 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 okay. Put it on, I just do the bottom lip. Okay, rub it together. Make sure it got there, okay? Then you have to let it try for a little while, like two minutes, three minutes. Some people do a lot longer. I don't think I have to do, I only do like two, three minutes. I get some few other things done. Um, what you're looking for is for it to get a little wider and it's gonna get tacky, really, is what you're gonna feel like. Um, so as we're waiting, I want to remind people that uh, this is a stain, a lip stain, but it's not um, a binding permanent color all day long. So yes, it has a longevity to it, um, much longer than any lipstick you're gonna use, like a normal lipstick, but it's, it's not, it's naturally based. It um, doesn't have chemical that's gonna be a binding thing. So you don't expect it to be lasting 24 hours. Um, does it have longevity though? 100%, it definitely does. I had it on for like six hours today, I ate food, I drink coffee and it lasted really well. Like I just put it on. Um, but there's some things that will kind of break it down a little bit and maybe not last as long is having greasy foods and putting glosses on. And um, that makes it not last as long. Is it still gonna have longer lasting than your other lipstick, than like normal lipstick? Yes. Um, but just kind of give it a heads up. I had a quesadilla today and it was just fine. Um, but if you have a ton of oily food, that's when it starts breaking down for some people. So starting to get tacky on me. So I don't want to make this too long for you. I'm just going to put it on now. But I probably wait a little bit longer. Like I said, two to three minutes at least. Um, I'm going to put on, what am I putting on? Oh, stop blushing first. So same thing as the primer. Um, you want to take off the extra stuff. You're not putting a ton on. So these are $18 each. The, um, the lipsticks are. You're getting to get a ton of uses out of it because you're wiping like every side down. If you have too much, it won't last as long. Weird. I don't know. But that's how it goes. So. Um, I put it in the middle first. Blend together. Make sure you get that little. I do my phone. Not the easiest way for me to do this. Okay. That's it. Okay. We're done. Now, right now, if I showed you, it would come off because it's still wet. You gotta let it dry. They suggest like 10 minutes before you like eat something. To make sure it's really on there that everything's kind of together. Um, so let me real quick. If you have any excess on there, just take it, do a little blob. See, most of it's already not transferring. It's been less than a minute. Um, so ten minutes for you to drink anything, and it sticks on good. So on my hand, I have my stop blushing and my love the wine you're with, and I mean, already they're not. It hasn't even been 10 minutes and they're not transferring. So, um, to take it off, all you need is a lip scrub or I use sometimes just my makeup remover wipes or we have awesome Bear It All wipes on Posh, um, scrubs on Posh too. It's naturally based, so use what you want to take it off, okay? And I hope you enjoy and um, like I said earlier, I had at least six hours of wear and I could have worn it all into the night. So there's definitely longevity to it, but each person's a little different. So I just don't want you to get thinking it's something else. So anyway, I'm really liking it. I hope you enjoy it too. Thanks.